we're at Pit Pockets in Middletown, Rhode Island on 510 East Main Road. Woo! This is a chicken gyro pocket with just chicken, lettuce, tomato, and special tahiki sauce. Mm. Chicken's actually really good. Look at the chicken now. That sauce tastes like um, mayonnaise with dill, a little pasta. Mm -hmm. About $10, I have to say the sandwich is pretty good. And definitely worth the money. Oh, purple onions too. This is what I call good eats. The chicken falafel wrap. The wrap falls a chicken gyro wrap, which was awesome. Chicken was very good. This is used by the same chicken. Made every morning, marinated. I love places when everything's cooked homemade. That's good. That's real good. I want you guys to come down here and check out Pit Pockets in Middletown, 510 on East Main Road, and get yourself a falafel chicken wrap or a chicken gyro and I mean, these two things are good. I'm pretty sure everything's good here. So I want you to come down and see what they got. Mm -hmm. We're at Anthony's Seafood on 963 Aquitnick Ave in Middletown, Rhode Island. And kind of keep it as simple. Anthony's Seafood, I didn't know there was a seafood market inside there, and there's a dining spot, and there's a line for takeout, so. The fish has light batter, and it's codfish. Hmm. Oh wow, that's actually really good. Hmm. See that? That's how you know it's good fish. It's not mushy, so you can stick a fork in it and, you know, Tastes like meat. But, unfortunately, I like how they put the wax paper too. The fish on top, so the fries don't get soggy. But, I mean, you guys know what these fries are. They're frozen. They're not bad. They're crispy. They're not like, um, they're not mushy from the fish in on top. Um, I give an example of approval, I will. Look at that nice fish. Mmm. How's that nice, nice meaty flavor? This is really good. Um, how much was it? $14, $14 for a large, so. See that right there? That's good. It's flake too. If you guys are in the neighborhood, come down to Anthony's Seafood. Have yourself some fish and chips. Yeah. What channel? What's it what's called? Nick's Great Eats and Excursions. All right, all right, all right. Check it out. All right. What are you eating right now? Just try the fish and chips. Everybody told me it's good here, so. Do it, man. Hey, hey, it's good. No, it's good. Huh? Spice. Asian spice? Yeah, I like that. Oh, got, oh, I didn't even know he went here. Yeah, right here. No shit. No, it's not calamari, bro. Ain't no local Alright. Alright. Check my channel. Alright, brother. Peace. Not bad, I didn't even know Guy Fieri came here. Know why? No, I kind of know this place is good because, I mean, there's like barely any pocket in the parking lot and the, the place is packed inside. Just come down to Anthony's Seafood and see for yourself. I know you guys love donuts. I love donuts, you love donuts, kids love donuts. Everybody loves donuts. So here we are at Ma's Donuts on 78 West Main Road in Middletown, Rhode Island. We're actually on episode three. Um, this is actually a great place. I've been here multiple times before. And not only have I had this 
one time, but this is actually my second time. And consistency is key when you go back to places. And every time I've been here, I've probably been here about, I don't know, say like five, maybe six times, and it's been consistent ever since. I've never had a bad coffee. I've never had a bad coffee roll. Even this big donut. You would think this donut would be dry. It'd be too heavy. It'd be cakey. This is literally a dozen donuts and one donut. This is a glazed donut with chocolate frosting and rainbow jimmies. I mean, as you guys can see, I mean, you see how soft this is? Like, let's just, let me just, let's just rip a piece real quick. Let's just try it. Let's try it. Hold on. Oh my God. Ah, oh, here we go. It's very moist. It pulls apart. You can literally split this with like the whole family. Look how big this is. Compared to my hand. Like, you see that? This is a very good moist donut. Worth the money. It's about seven dollars. I mean, you get me a pay for freshness, consistency, and most of all, quality. This is a very good donut. You don't taste the oil in it, as if you were gonna have a glazed donut at Dunkin' Donuts. This is a very good donut, good quality, and um, what's better than that? It's also fresh. This place is open for 24 hours. Yes, 24 hours. You can come here at 3.30 in the morning, grab a coffee roll, a Danish, a coffee, a tea. You can grab anything you want for 24 hours, which is insane at how good of the quality we have. It's nighttime, we'll do a nighttime review. Uh, we're on 27 Aquitnik Ave at Aquitnik Pizzeria. Ooh, that's tucked towards us. Uh, we're gonna this traditional pizza. I was gonna get the buffalo chicken, but uh, it said right on the thing I had Frank's Red Hot, so we stay away from Frank's Red Hot. Not bad. Oh yeah, time to burn myself. Hmm. Not bad. Um, I put the um, Parmesan cheese and the uh, red pepper flakes on it myself because that's a must. Mm. It's not that, it's greasy, but it's not that bad where it's like dripping on my forearm. Not a bad pizza. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Mm. We might stick to basic pizza because I feel like a lot of people don't really go out and get specialty pizzas. A lot of cheese, pepperoni, more toppings, but I do like my buffalo chicken pizza. I do like this spot. The crust kind of reminds me of um, Four River House of Pizza in Fall River. Sauce is actually pretty good. I don't have that strong tomato flavor and that acid taste. It actually tastes pretty good. Um, I do approve the pizza. I like it. I'm um, gonna get a little combo. I got wings too, so we're gonna check the wings out. I got hot buffalo wings. As we can see, they did not put the bread in on the wings, so it's just the skin, which is an A plus for me. Ooh, these are wet. These are wet wings. <laughs> right, like I said, I love when they don't put the batter on the wings, because when the batter's already on the wings, I feel like they're frozen. Mm. Messy wing. You know what? This place gets the next stamp of approval. I'm gonna give the stamp of approval to the wings and to the uh, pepperoni pizza. I don't know what about anything else, but this is pretty good. I hope you guys come down here and check this out. Very small little area, very nice beaches up the road. I know the weather's, the weather's a little, you know, going away from us for the beach, but we're here in Middletown. Um, this is the last episode, we're wrapping it up. I did also go to Carmelo's Pizza on East Main Ave in Middletown. Uh, something happened to the video, but that pizza place is really good. Me and my dad used to go there. Went there a few times when I was a kid. I do recommend that place. I might actually throw that in real quick to a Newport episode, and uh, you know, we'll just keep the uh, keep it rolling. Um, like I said, it's Nick's Great Eats, and we're out of here.